Hello and welcome to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. We're robbing a train. I'm. It's still the middle of the night. You can't save in this spot. <laughs> so I guess I have no choice. Gotta. I gotta keep going like them. Uh, which right uh, okay there's me uh -huh. where's my guns <laughs> there I'll, I'll take my rifle thank you we seems to be a merry gang Yep. Time to hit the train. So I've been going for quite a while now and I feel it's still in the tutorial area so... <laughs> It's a rather slow paced in the game, in a good way, that is. I don't like rushing things. It's very nice scenery here. John in the cabin. <laughs> you sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Looks like we are he heading into the so lowland. This, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. Oh, I bet we're you're going back there at some time. Place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back. What's that? I say we go back, and that's the end of it. Money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money once we work out how to cash them. Now, everyone, <laughs> shut up and get your mind on the job at hand. Railroad bonds. And yeah, that would be probably be a bit hard to cash in, especially if they're stolen. Oh, I had to move forward a bit. <laughs> yeah. You want to see him down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Check on Bill. What is the way down here? <laughs> this way? Yeah. How are you doing, Bill? How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Oh, there he is. I was looking at the water tower. <laughs> right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Okay. Pick up the spool. Is that really far enough? I 
think I would have moved a little bit further. Ah. Okay. You actually That's cut good. it. All right. That should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. All right. Okay, boy. The horse likes me a bit better. <laughs> I haven't petted in the, in a while. All of you, no mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. I wasn't going to hit the back. Can I pet the horse from here? I don't think so. No, I don't want to. Oh. That's draw, draw and stow. <laughs> Do I have to move over to build or something? No, I mean to Dutch. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. <laughs> Switch to the item wheel. Winter gloves. Ah. Hides your identity while committing crimes. How useful. <laughs> Here's the train. You ready, Bill? It's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Blow it up. Here we go. Doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> That's too funny. It was fine. It was my fault. Come on. You're pathetic. You know that? Let's get it. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> oh, he fell off. Well, he's fine. Pull. Yeah, you're okay. Now, let's go slow this thing down. Where's Javier? He fell off. The others will get him. Let's go. I think I'm going to bring my. Oh. Come on, we need to stop this train. There's another guard over here. Use my pistol. Crap. L2, not R2, to speak. But I guess that's one way of solving stuff as well, just shoot. <laughs> oh, who's shooting me? Ah, in there. There's another guy behind here. There. Take him out. The misfired, apparently, for some reason. Yeah. 
Can I get up here? Oh yeah. Shouldn't we push up? How you doing there? I'm okay. Let's go. Yeah, I heard you. <laughs> oh, ouch. Come, help me. Reverse to grapple. Ah. Circle. Poor guy. He's just... <laughs> He's just driving the train. Stop it. More guys. Got him. Oh, there will be. Ah, keep missing. There we go. One more. You too. Still okay? I think so. Good. <laughs> oh, he could take more than one hit. Oh, he's, he already got a bear. Did I get him? No. Let's see. There. Even more. Let's get up here. That seemed like a good place to hide. Find them. <laughs> These are tough bastards. Horses? Good shoot, kid. I can see now why the old Driscoll brought so many boys up here for this. Oh. Uh, okay, I didn't die. <laughs> That's our boys. With the fruiting. Yeah, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Yes. Yeah. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. They're going to blow it up. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. And so. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four, three, two, oh, they'll one. open it. <laughs> Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. Aha. Uh -huh. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Now, don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. R2. Seems good enough. Now light the fuse. Here we go. <laughs> now run. Back to the horse at least. <laughs> There we go. All right, come on. Just walk on out here. We don't want to kill you. 
Oh, they're giving up. Get on up there. Search that train. Yep. A little bit of changing plans from the original thing. <laughs> but Look what did they save? Uh, like plan never oh, never sure. survives the first gunshot, oh, at least in war. Oh yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> Do I need to eat or something? Because I feel a bit slow. Fine brandy. Mining company letter to Cornwall. Nothing on the back side. There. See? That's how it's done. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Bond? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we Scar. Give me those. That's it. Railroad contracts. Invoices, blah blah blah. You got anything? Any bonds anywhere? There's a from the Spanish West Indies. Nice looking chest. Probably the bonds are probably in there. Fancy new boat he's ordered from Europe. <laughs> I am not robbing another boat as long Bond. as I live. <laughs> Think I got him. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. <clears throat> <sighs> What did you find? These some bonds. bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you they can stay. I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. All right. Okay, get on the train, quick. Oh, on the train. I thought I could choose. Ideas, I kill all three. So behave. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul. I swear. Oh, you will probably tell anyone, everyone, when you get back. <laughs> well, if I start to train here, they might not make it anyway. Go in. Let's fire up this beast again. Horse. Like we're heading east. So we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem as long as we keep our noses clean. Well, I don't trust anyone who says it's no problem. <laughs> Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Yep, we're setting out.
there's one thing that's better in this game than Horizon, and that's the water effects. They've done that really, really well. Especially when you're out of it. It looked a bit strange when the horses stepped in it, but... Nothing's perfect. Nice music as well. Lenny, Micah, get over here. Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead. Make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me with the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. <laughs> you can buy me a whiskey. Guess it's time to prepare the gun again. Or maybe not. Oh, I'm driving. <laughs> Something's definitely up. Who's next to me? I know he said it, but I can't remember his name. It's the old guy. Oh crap. Okay. Let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything nope. look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right. Let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. I didn't break that bad if it just fell off. Put the wheel back on, you still strong enough to hold up a wing? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. Oh. Yeah, I'm trying. Okay, there we go. Bash it. Which reminds me, I gotta change my wheels on the car to winter tires soon. So I have a feeling. We're going to get lots of snow soon. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, oh, we Indians. Have seen them. Poor bastards. Hello there. Really yeah, they're them over down here. Come they're on, the real victims in this country. Well, get in. I'll tell you. <laughs> Maybe that's uh, why Bill has a soft or Dutch has a soft spot for him. So, yes, the Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country, they lost it all. Yeah. Stole them clean away from them, it was every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. How's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. It's not different, but it's not nice some any, either. Of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people <laughs> pleasantly? We don't. In spite of Dutch's talk. I fear I was True. perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds con fancy man. don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. I guess we'll learn about the history of these people so, a bit more. What happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. 
When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man. And You're now hot. Hold on him. Around 13, Avoid becoming too hot. To make sure you wear clothes appropriate for the environment. Maybe a little older. Wait, that's not Wilder here. Wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marsh. How do I switch clothes on the horse? Sir? Well, that's probably not easy while I'm staring. So. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. Yeah. We still heading the right Kind of lazy horses. Like you have to hitting him to, to or horse. In search of I have to hit him to move. In virgin forests as we plan. No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yep. Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. <laughs> Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. Who's the Pinkertons? Is that the... Uh, the law. What's it called again? Horseshoe like a nickname for him. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. I guess that's the really yellow campsite that you can just, see on the compass. You know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. Did he lose uh, the way it is. his girlfriend or something there? Me, you, is this when he turned crazy? We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. Oh, I can hold forward to accelerate as well. What are you working on there, anyway? Old habits die hard. <laughs> Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. No, oh, there is door. Okay. There are two horses. Oops, we're going up this way. Got some ginseng. Yep. These can replenish your cores used in cooking as well, or to craft items. And plants can be found all over the world. We we've, we've seen that before. Right. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Okay. Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting yeah. in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. Good. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. I wonder if I'm going to run with the gang or if we're going to run around. I'm going to run around alone. But since we had to provide gang supplies, I guess this is a gang operation all the way. <laughs> Here's the camp. Seems so, all right. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Jose. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. At least some of us. Not that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money. 
and a long way from a dream of virgin land in the west i know there is no virgin land in the west anymore safe we make a bit of money here then we move again head out around them be west of uncle sam in a few months buy some land i hope so would you just look around you this world has its consolations <laughs> gentlemen I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, okay. Herr Strauss. I prefer Robin Banks to usury. <laughs> Seems ah. more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. It's the pep talk. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now. And we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out okay. there and see what you can find. Sure don't look like Uncle, factory workers, but Reverend that's alright. No more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. Guess that includes me. A little way down the track, name of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets Donate money and val slice. valuables to camp and upgrade ammo, now, food, and other camp supplies. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most your How do you Black keep your hair that way? Everything apart from my in all of this. Oh, don't mind me. <laughs> well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I Sleep, shave, or say change clothes you at your tent. Properly. He's smoking as well. Chapter 2. couple of weeks later. We got off the mountain and rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartland. We've been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. <laughs> he's not as crazy. Jose. He seems a bit happier as well. <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. Looks There's like it's nice weather and boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, hot and or warm at this. Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> All right. And I'm gonna end the episode, so... Until next time, bye-bye.